everybody, welcome back to Aqua Pony Productions, and today is the second episode of the Flutter Starlight Sparkler event. So, we are going to check our moths in six minutes. This moth is going, the day moth is going to get enough relief fed to her, and and the wasp moth is about ready to hatch. So let's hatch him or her. I haven't decided the gender for the moth yet. So let's turn the volume up. Yep, hear that? It's the beautiful music. Now, here it is. The wasp moth. Hey, Captain. So here he is, and he looks really cool. And now let's go to the scrapbook, the Flutterpedia, and retrieve some stuff. Here is an image of him. We're going to call it him because the hairstyle looks kind of like a him. Here are some of the other moths. There's the bee fly, which could go booga 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 booga. Let's go. Booga 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 booga. The bee fly is dancing. Oh yeah. And she's fat. Because. I'll call her Wally. I just call her bee fly. There's some more moths. There's this. Guy from the Hanukkah event, the Shazmash. I can't pronounce the name. The names on this game are really weird. Like, they should just name them basic names like Polka Dot Moth, Pink Moth, Yellow Moth. Well, that would be boring. The whole point of the game is to have it be more interesting. <laughs> Apparently, the Flutter Moths are in the. According. Oh my mom. Yeah, the okay, flood. Okay, you have to check on on Z, Z, yeah, because she. Elizabeth's imaginary friend. Yeah, Zia yeah, loves. Well, but still, it, but still, it, you don't want to hear about Elizabeth's Zia friend. Zia yeah, loves our wow videos. Oh, okay, we. Okay, I get it. Sorry about Elizabeth. She has been really loud about her imaginary friend. I bet you guys want to see my moths and studs. So here, and and here is some more moths. And let's trigger the special event on our new moth, the wasp moth. Yeah, you don't love Ugh. our wasp. You don't. Elizabeth. Now she. Now you don't. Sorry about that. I finally got Elizabeth to talk to Zia somewhere else. So now let's trigger the special event and decorations special abilities on the wasp moth. So here it is the broadleaf star flower. And it adds a useless metallic aura onto. When it moths like this. Now, Wasp has a nice aura, and he is really rocking it. And it looks like he is also going to try and get a girl. I'm going to pretend he's trying to get a girl. A He's still a single Pringle, so let's find him a girl. Oh look, there's a girl. One of the moths I got from the Sazmash event. The grass, the amphis, grass moth. Although he does not like her. Hi, I'm a wasp moth and I'm trying to get a girl. And I sound really drunk right now. <gasps> Hey, Bee Fly, can you be my girlfriend? <laughs> no. 
<gasps> Why does every girl hate me? Okay, enough goofing around. It looks like he this Spanish moon moth got me something. Let's see if we could get a zodiac moth to get us a 10% large flower. And I think the grass moth shall. Or the Spanish moon moth. Let's find the Spanish moon moth. Oh, hi, man, man. Oh, hi, man, man. Oh, yes, you manly. Although it, so manly. although it doesn't look like. Oh, there she is. So manly. Get over here. Or. <laughs> oh, look a pedal. Pedal pursuit. Pedal pursuit. There. Elizabeth, do you know what imaginary means? It looks like. It looks like we got the zodiac moth. I forgot his name, but let's just call him the zodiac moth. And and he is going to do the quest summon, and let, so let's send him. Bombayage. Now it looks like poor little wasp is still looking up for some girls. There's a hot lady in above him, although oh it he's she took her his spot. And it looks like this moth is going to get some food. It looks like your unknown species. Caterpillar is near or completed to cocoon stage, so that's great. And I'm going to return once this caterpillar is in her cocoon and I'm about to hatch her. So it's an hour and a half now and Little Day is ready to hatch out of her pupa. So let's see what she looks like as a moth. Let's see that. Wow. She looks oh. like Pumida. Wow. She's really, <sighs> really, really pretty looking moth. Wow, they looks really pretty. Yeah, that's what I said. And it looks like Elizabeth's also here with me. So that's nice. But here is a Pule Sheila Day Fly Moth. Day the Pule Sheila Day Fly Moth. Uh, out of my way, Bee Fly. Still here she is. She is all pretty and detailed. And, and she looks really feminine with her little curly antennas, which is nice. A bee fly, Olivia. What? Uh, okay. Now let's collect act f all the other moths. They're producing a whole lot of little fireflies. You could see it, the purple ones, the purple ones, or the special ones. to produce the event flowers and sorry if Elizabeth's doing a lot of annoying stuff she is just throwing her pony toy everywhere Pinky, so crazy. Okay. don't do that Elizabeth
Elizabeth. And time to feed Trevor the frog. Trevor's an ugly name. Oh, why I don't see Abu? Oh, no. Because that's a real thing. Oh. You forgot that. I think he would be better if he had a different name. No. Let's see that. And it looks like we could buy stuff. So we are going to buy this rare fee flower and a twig. Because why not? Okay. And now let's see all the flowers. Oh. Oh. I'm Sorry about I'm that. Not gonna... Sorry about that. I've been. It's kind of getting a bit slow, but that's fine. It looks like we only need one more flower and. We are going to get be able to get leaf roller, aka colorful meter mark leaf roller. But we're going to call him or her whatever gender a leaf roller. And then only three more flowers until we get this one and this one. So we're making some pretty good apparel grass on the sparkler event. Hey, what are you doing, Amanda? You're not playing the iPad right. You're supposed to do it like this. So, yeah. No, you're not supposed um, to do it like that. <clears throat> well, yeah. Okay, I have a better way. And now, time to activate the Mayflower decorations. Uh, Special ability, it's my favorite special ability because it produces pollen. So we are going to activate it. And now a lot, now we have a lot of pollen for our sparkler moss and the bee fly. The bee fly is going to produce a lot of cool gifts for us so stay tuned for that in the next episode so that's the end of this episode and if you liked it subscribe for more awesome videos and bye